Welcome to an NPH Action Fund webinar on talking to voters about Yes on K, the San Mateo County Affordable Housing Measure on the November 2016 ballot. NPH Action Fund and the Nonprofit Housing Association, working with our partner, the Housing Leadership Council of San Mateo County, and other housing advocates across the Bay Area, have trained more than 250 residents, co-workers, and supporters on how to talk to voters on these critical measures. Today we're going to focus on Yes on K in San Mateo County and give you some tips and techniques for sharing information with residents, coworkers, and neighbors. You'll find companion webinars on voter registration and voter education that will provide a greater overview on the program overall. But let's talk about Measure K. Measure K will be on the November 2016 ballot in San Mateo County. It's a very popular measure that addresses the critical needs voters and residents agree on in San Mateo County. People are excited about Measure K and eager to learn more about it. One of the things we've learned and that you can learn more about in the companion web webinar on talking to voters is that the most persuasive way to contact, connect with voters is to share our own stories. Uh, and to share our own motivations and reasons in addition to a few facts and figures. Voters do need to know that Measure K is on their ballot. It's a long ballot this year with many state propositions as well as other local measures and offices. But voters will respond to your personal story, the information you choose to share and the narrative, not a hard sell. And so the best way to start is with your own story. Let's take a look at the best way to develop a short version of the story of your personal motivation for supporting Measure K. You can use a piece of scrap paper to jot down three reasons, three short sentences about why you support Measure K and condense that into sort of an elevator pitch that explains the reasons you support Measure K. If you work in affordable homes, live in affordable homes, or support affordable homes, it's great to start that and share some of your own experiences about the difference that affordable homes makes for our seniors, veterans, working families, people with disabilities, and everybody struggling to stay in our expensive Bay Area. You'll find at the end of this webinar links to a website where you can discover more information about Measure K and how it will work. Measure K is an extension of the very popular Measure A, overwhelmingly approved by San Mateo County voters in 2002. Measure K will build on the success of that previous measure and continue its important investments in emergency services, uh, addressing early learning and the literacy gap, fighting homelessness, uh, improving health care, reducing childhood poverty, as well as upgrades to county parks. But Measure K will also provide additional resources over the long term for supporting affordable homes for seniors, people with disabilities, veterans, and working families, critically important and necessary services that so many San Mateo County residents and voters are excited about. Measure K as I just mentioned, will expand the capacity of San Mateo County to reinvest in our communities for affordable homes for renters and homeowners. The full text of the Measure K ballot question is here and on the Measure K website. We encourage you to take a close look at this ballot question as it includes the issues that are most important to voters and that they want to see San Mateo County address in the immediate future. There are many benefits to Measure K, including strong fiscal accountability with independent audits and citizen oversight. Every dollar raised will stay in San Mateo County to benefit residents in all communities. And we invite you to visit yesonk.net to learn more about the benefits of Measure K and what it will accomplish in San Mateo County. If you're interested in volunteering, we hope you'll email the address on your screen, also accessible through that website, and 
sign up to help reach out to voters in San Mateo County about Measure K. So how can I help? I'm glad you asked. You can visit our website and endorse Measure K. You can sign a pledge to vote card and make a plan to vote now. Know where and when you'll vote, whether you will mail in your ballot or vote at the polls on November 8th. And you can help us reach out to residents and coworkers uh, with some of the NPH action materials. You may have seen these already, but we have flyers in seven languages for Measure K in San Mateo County, as well as pledge cards that are useful throughout the Bay Area. The pledge card calls on a voter to pledge to vote. It doesn't do a hard sell or ask people how they'll be voting, uh, but it does um, allow you to collect some information and know who we've talked to. Uh, and both of these items can be ordered uh, from the website on your screen at nonprofithousing.org, campaigns, NPH Action Fund. And on that same website, you'll find links um, to other materials uh, and links to the training webinars we mentioned earlier on voter registration as well as voter education. Thanks for all you're doing to support Measure K and all of our measures across the Bay Area this year. And we look forward to uh, partnering with everyone in communities and making sure that these important measures uh, pass on November 8th and begin getting results for our communities. Thank you.